Test one, two, three, four. Test one, two, three, four. Test one, two, three, four. I'd like to investigate storyboarding more concretely because I'm, I'm new to this multimodal writing game. I'm still figuring out those processes and at the moment I, I'll spend hours on a two or three minute clip because I'm, I'm learning the technology. I'm also learning the kind of genre that I'm meant, meant to be trying to reproduce, right? Yeah. So I'm not, at a, I'm not at a stage in my own multimodal writing career to really be able to storyboard stuff accurately because I kind of I'm kind of making it up as I go along plus because but well, both of us are writing a, a multimedia dissertation right there really isn't um, a template for us right so I'm looking towards kind of more emerging like YouTube genres and little tricks that I see like I see a nice cut edit in a YouTube movie it's like oh I want to learn how to use that right so I'm more grabbing these discrete elements and kind of keeping a running tally on them and trying them out, which I think down the road will become part of the storyboarding process. Like I'll know what kind of effect I want to use because I know what its rhetorical position is. At the moment I don't, right? So it's very much a kind of, I'm, I'm in that kind of experimental invention phase with regards to multimodal writing. And it really makes me think differently about like what a, what a transition is or the kinds of tricks that we use in textual writing are, are, are beginning to change for me.